we're gonna go into the makeup. I'm gonna go from day, smoldering look. I already apply my foundation. And of course, you may already know, I am going more organic as I can. This one is by Alima Pure, and it's a beautiful foundation, super natural, and just glow. Finally got my hands on the Tarte. This is the bomb. And these damn mosquitoes! I feel like food here, seriously, because they're eating me up. I feel violated. So for highlighting, I want to go all out bombshell mode. So I'm going to use this one in gold because I got a serious tan. And this looks beautiful when you have a tan. Let's just be honest because my pale ass in the winter just doesn't work with this gold highlighter. I love this highlighter because you can apply it to you like if you like it heavy, a beautiful high shine. <laughs> if you could only see my legs. Thank God I'm from New York. Because they got nothing on me. Use the Huda Beauty palette. I love this palette. First, I'm going to set my eyes. I'm gonna go into bay. So there's a lot of French people here. It's I thought it was gonna be more of a culture shock because I've never really been around so many French people. But you know, it's pretty quiet around here actually. And you see a few people, you don't see too many people. And I've noticed that they're not very like, they're not super like, I don't wanna say friendly because maybe they are friendly, but it doesn't come across like that. They're like, they're not really social, I guess maybe outsiders or something, I don't know. Let's go in with sandalwood. I don't know, I feel like doing something smoky and sexy. You know, the nightlife here in this side hasn't been up to par. We haven't gotten to really get dressed up and have and have with the nightlife aspect here. But I haven't gotten to do something like smoky and sexy and like blown out. So this is kind of nice to be able to apply a little bit of makeup and really turn it up, you know? Next, I will go in with Hannah. My boyfriend is literally under the table that I'm filming, swatting away these effing flies because they're freaking relentless. Now my boyfriend is abusing me. <laughs> <laughs> Color here is calling my name. Matt ear is just so beautiful. Right in the crease area as well, so we're just building the color here. Funny how this color has become so big now because women were so afraid of using any red tones around their eyes before because, you know, it's not an easy color to pull off. You know, you can look tired or like a vampire really quick and it's become like the it color. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna cut the crease a little bit so I can open that area up. So I'm gonna use a tart. And I'm gonna put it right at the middle here. I'm in the mood to use reds. So I'm gonna use flame right over it. This color is amazing! I'm on vacation with Oprah. With Oprah? Mm -hmm. What? Amazing! Oh my God! <laughs> You know Oprah's coming out with a movie, right? Wow, look at this color. It's like ruby, like ruby slippers. For the inner corners, windows. Babe, how are you holding up in the water front? <laughs> look how beautiful. You're starting to see the difference in colors. It's giving it depth, but it also looks beautiful and enhances the eyes. So because I feel like it needs something else, I'm gonna go ahead and use the steel Let's go retro right over the red in the middle here and just enhance it a little bit more. So on the bottom, I pretty much do the same thing that we did on the top. So I'm gonna start off again with the sandalwood. Okay, so now I'm gonna pick up the second color, which was that orangish brown color. And then we're gonna take that red, we're gonna get even closer to the lash line. What I'm just gonna do is define my eyes on the top to make my lashes appear fuller. So I'm just using a black eyeliner. So any of these will look beautiful, I find. So since I can't make a choice because they're both gorgeous in my eyes. Babe, which one should I do? Should I do a wine or should I do a brown with this eye color? 
brown. Brown? Brown it is. Oh my god, there's a dead mosquito right on my yeah. shirt. So I will finish the other eye, do my eyebrow, and I will be right black. I mean, right black. <laughs> Voila! So now it is time for bronzer. And what I'm gonna use is this one by RMS. I'll write the name below because I can't even make out what it says, but this has replaced my MAC Dark Deep. It's non-toxic, chemical-free. And it gives me a beautiful, beautiful bronzy glow. I'm obsessed with this stuff. But I'm going all out. This is Rose Pearl by Bite. Mamma mia. If you haven't tried it, you should. It's chemical free, but it's so luxurious. It's beautiful. I've, I've talked about this in one of my other videos. I'll link it down below in case you're interested. It's so prismatic, and when the sun hits it, it's like you're glowing. My babe just fell off the balcony. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just kidding. I'm